So it's a major move right here, folks. This information never been told. And I'm for to connect this with what is the sixth God. Just in case people ask and they say, well, what is that? All it is, is Lucifer having control over all the elements. And believe it, <clears throat> believe it or not, folks, there's more. I'll talk about that in the near future. But on this discussion, we're going to discuss and we're going to tie in why the world uses the image of kids, the term young, little, and all of that stuff. And was angels born babies? And if they was in heaven, why did God allow Lucifer to grow up as a teenager angel, an adult angel, and then finally get kicked out with the one third? Because it's never been told. They don't talk about this. They run y'all in a million everywhere. So with that being said, we're going to discuss first humbling yourself as a child because that that's in the scriptures stuff that's in the scriptures and it says uh humble yourself in the presence like a child what that mean is just basically letting all of that other stuff go and just you know woosa and um it 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 is it's it's basically like why why get mad at, at the, what God is talking to us in our minds and souls and bodies, basically? So, why are some of the strongest characters, even in TV shows, like I wouldn't be surprised if the strongest, the ultimate robot in the future is, is some kid, boy, or some girl. I seen these shows growing up, cartoons, all the strong characters, with some with some young kid or some baby type of situation. We even got a rapper named Baby. No 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 diss to uh this ain't no diss to as far as like um exposing celebrity. I already done exposed them to the max. This is about breaking this down breaking certain situations down including Jesus and you know just understanding certain stuff i've discussed to y'all about demons and how they work how they operate and go into people's bodies how a lot of these family members around the world prophesize kids demons and they know ahead of time like they knew ahead of time jesus was coming me was coming you was coming that's listening and everybody else you know um they set up side rules and situations and traps um but if that is the case and if angels did grow up as teenagers then that mean that they had some type of experience as kid you know they they know which is reason why we were lied to growing up they that's why they got to get us young because as long as they can have have us Cause some of us break out of the curse. You know, we break out of these family members that is uh, sacrificing kids, witchcraft. You break out of that stuff. Um, and some people continue. They get rich off of it. They hide it. They feed all of their mouths and stuff. And then they say, well, what, what, what else I was gonna, what else I was gonna do? You know, like we gotta eat and and things like that. They try to put uh, reasons on why they sold they self short. Not even your soul, cause you that's God's in the end anyway, like Satan, his soul is God's. You know, like why does it happen? Why when the demon goes into a baby and then they sacrifice the baby? Like if a, a like how do you even know that a baby is being born a, like and it's gonna grow up to be evil. And like like Hitler and them. When God could have just slayed it. But he's not like the enemy. The enemy is pure unadulterated evil. 
Some people think that because God created Satan, that he's just as evil as Satan. And that's not the case. He created, he created that because he had to put a boundary in between free will and who we are as people. Because without, without Satan being around and God protecting his people, like he said, he would never uh, leave us or forsake us. Even even if we die in this in this life, because a lot of us, you know, the bully is what it is in the end. You know, the Bible people failed it. Even you Egyptians and the angels, the good angels, they're dead good angels that are dead. So all that stuff occur. Why not try to get closer to truth? You folks are living in now. You've never heard this before. I've never heard this before. God showed me this. And actually, here's the thing. I did a topic a few hours ago to this. Right now, it's Saturday night. And I believe, what, what, what's the... Saturday night, December 3rd, to be exact. I did this same topic a few hours ago. I said, no, nah, that was trash. Because I ain't like the way I worded some stuff. So I say, let me do it over. Because that's how much I have for when I do when I do things. I want it to be worded right. You know, I don't want, um, um, and nah, I didn't mess, me, make a mistake and use profanity. I'm, I'm talking about worded where you can understand it. So what is the sixth God once again? That is Lucifer having control over the element. Point blank. He is not the... Sh he, Lucifer is only the father of lies. There are other things that I'm going to expose to y'all or reveal to y'all that is going to blow your minds away regarding this information that God is letting me receive. This stuff is going... It's, it's getting deep. Things is changing. New year, new elements, new stuff. And to, I'm not even going to say year. Every year, it's the same stuff. Just get worse. Nothing new under the sun. You know, that, that the games is actually old. And it's just new people, new technology. Technology have left the demons in the past. So, I just wanted to like, let y'all understand that. Yes, you had, you had small angels. One third grew up. God set aside what he needed to set aside. That's why they got to get us as kids. We go through stuff as kids. Some people is traumatized. They never get over some of the stuff that they went through. And they carry that stuff with them into adults. And they become rapists, they become demons, killers, you know, destroying people's families, sorcerers, and it never stops. Mad scientists, mad doctors, mad lawyers, mad cops, because of the anger within. And I tell people, like, if there's worse stories, this is just one state. And other people have heard, like, you know, all of these different stories in different third world countries. And then they get mad at their situations or they can't even try to put in some work for, for, for Jesus. They have to use other people's name and image because they imposters, clones. And to me, everything clone. Like, I got several you know phones like i got multiple fingers you know there's multiple couches of this you know there's multiple like cars on the road that are the same i'm not gonna get into that but the main purpose of the situation is 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 the fact that these gremlins or they have tremendous power these short individuals that have ran the world 
for a long time. Y'all, y'all ain't noticed that the most popular people were always some short people. And they used references of uh, kids and stuff like that. And um, it's a unique way of s sliding they self in, slithering <laughs> they self in to all of these problems that's going on in the world. So don't be surprised at abortions. Don't be surprised that granddaddy, grandma them is uh, in on the sacrifices. They know exactly what's going on. And that's how, they, that's how these people is coming up daily. You know, and it's sad to think that and they, and they feel like, how, how is that a sacrifice when it was planned? It, it, it was planned, we knew. It, it, it was our kid, you know, people that we knew, they wanted it to happen, et cetera, et cetera. And uh, God sees it. He don't tolerate it. He's not down with witchcraft. He's not down with a lot of stuff. And people just need to understand it. And I had something else on my mind that I was trying to got so trying to get all of this stuff out. See, it's hard. It's difficult, difficult to um to do messages on camera because your mind be racing as you thinking, and you be trying to get everything out while you talking for that topic specifically. And you sometimes you you go over and you be like, "Dang, I should have said something." So I'm trying. That's what I'm trying to figure out now. As if I concluded everything I needed to on this topic. So I talked about 